Good evening, 47. Your destination is the Paris Fashion Show by Sanguin, one of Europe's leading couture brands. Your targets are Sanguin owner Viktor Novikov, a former oligarch turned fashion mogul, and his partner Dahlia Margolis, a retired supermodel, an iconic power couple on the global fashion scene, and two of the most dangerous people in the world. Novikov and Margolis are in fact the ringleaders of Iago, an enigmatic spy ring that deals in the global elite's most valuable secrets. Unscrupulous and opportunistic, Iago has caused disastrous security leaks all over the globe. When Crimean separatists caused a deadly meltdown at the Odessa nuclear power plant, Iago gave them access to the plant's security network. And when the Delgado drug cartel shot down the plane of President Hernandez and his family, Iago provided the classified flight plans. Now Novikov and Mogolis have obtained a knock list of British undercover agents, which they plan to sell at a secret Iago auction during the Sanguine show. So our client, MI6, need us to stop the ringleaders before the knock list ends up in the wrong hands. The Sanguine show will be swarming with security, and Viktor Novikov will be the focus of everyone's attention. But despite his posturing, he is merely the money man. The real target is Dahlia Margolis. Beautiful and brilliant, she is a master manipulator and the true brains behind Iago. Two targets, a highly public event. At first glance, an impossible task. Then again, I do know how you love a challenge. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Paris 47. The show is just about to start. This is the red carpet event of the season and the guest list is a veritable who's who of the global fashion elite. You will find Victor Novikov basket in the spotlight, while Dalia Margolis hosts the heavily guarded auction on the second floor for a group of Iago's top customers. Now, event security will keep a watchful eye on any suspicious activity, but I trust your timeless look shall fit right in. Good luck. Sir, enjoy the show. <laughs> I wish I had that job. We can't have any of the builders. Thought 
Hamza. Al-Ghazali. Excellency Sheik Al Ghazali. Miss Margolis invites you to join her in her office. No further bid. Well, they say that money makes people go blind. If that is true, you pick the perfect disguise. It's an honor serving you, sir. Sheikh Salman al-Ghazali, heir to one of the largest fortunes in Arabia. And yet you bother to dabble in politics. Very commendable. You had something to show me? Oh, I do indeed. My organization has serendipitously acquired a list of names. British MI6 agents working in your very backyard. A knock list? Now, I normally don't like to play favorites, but I do like to see my merchandise put to good use. And I think I know a perfect match when I see one. So how about it? Interested? I'm interested. Excellent. It's off the table, then. We shall settle the details tomorrow. A pleasure doing business with you, Your Excellency.
Mr. Novikov is next.
mind? Just give us five minutes, okay? Everything okay? Good. Uh, we'd like to be alone here. Thank you. Mr. Novikov, Decker here. I'm at the show. Well, we could hardly predict a pile-up on the freeway, could we? So you have a spot in mind, or...? Okay, fine. We'll wait in the lounge. Is there a problem? Novikov is busy. Told us to stay put and enjoy ourselves. One of his security staff will come fetch us. He's ready. Tell you where we're going? Pavilion, Northwest Gardens. Said it was away from prying eyes. Novikov is meeting Max Decker, a senior agent in the Russian FSB. Small world. The FSB has been mounting a criminal case against Novikov, but Decker's boss, FSB Section Chief Nikolai Kamarov, committed suicide only last night. Or perhaps not. Either way, this could be a chance to catch Novikov away from the spotlight. Mr. Decker, Mr. Novikov will see you now. I will escort you to the rendezvous point. Ah, great. Thank you, lead the way. Hey, what's up? Escorting Max Decker. Mr. Novikov's orders. Been expecting you. Go ahead. Well, well. No Novikov. Why am I not surprised? Maybe he's fashionably late, sir. Droll, Carson. Mr. Novikov, I'm at the pavilion. We did wait. Then your guide took us to meet you here, so which is it? I don't know. Security guy. Or uniform. Well done, Fortis. Novikov is about to meet with Decker, and you have a front row seat. He's coming. Our parking doesn't expire. 
So, uh, I, I gotta ask, Mr. Gunner. Section Chief Copper, was, uh, is that your handiwork? Look at these hands. I'm a bureaucrat, Carson. I don't go around staging perfect suicides. No, I dare say young Kamarov got a taste of Viktor Novikov. Ask me, he had it coming anyway. Nobody likes an overachiever. And the file. Must be pretty important for Novikov to cough up seven digits. It's in it. Every bit of dirty intel the FSB ever collected on him. Our friend Novikov wasn't always in fashion, Carson. But the public has a short memory span. Ah, and now he's tying up loose ends. Securing his legacy and our retirement plans. Mr. Decker, how are things at the office? That's 91 all over again. Kamarov is found dead, gun in hand, office locked from the inside. In his safe, evidence that he was leaking state secrets to Langley. An FSB section chief, Kremlin's golden boy, a CIA spy. <laughs> Look, I don't know who you hired to pull this off, but I want his number. Trust me. You don't. The case file, please. Right, right. Of course. Last and only copy. There was an unfortunate server room fire at HQ. Misery loves company. Oh, Mr. Decker. <laughs> you know, I do believe this is going to be the start of a beautiful friendship. The money's being wired to your account. Do I need to call my guy in Switzerland? <laughs> Why, haven't you heard? I am an honest businessman. Do svidania, Mr. Decker. Ah, <sighs> well, that's that. Take a stroll, would you, Kurt? I'd like to savor the moment. You sure that's wise, sir? I'll be fine. Finally, a clean slate. Didn't come cheap, but it was damn well worth it. Victor, old boy, you're walking on water. Targets are down. Great work. Now head towards an exit.
How was Moscow? Kamarov is gone. I set him up as a Langley spy. It's quite the scandal at the FSB. His death will not be investigated. Your turn. Very well. The secrets of the global elite. Five years of work. Everything we've collected. This thing makes WikiLeaks look like a gossip rag. The pen beats the sword, huh? I have found that whoever wields the sword decides who holds the pen. Smile, Victor. Your reputation is safe. Now run along. I'm sure you have pretty dresses to attend to. Victor, good luck with the show. I have a feeling it's going to be the one you'll be remembered for. <laughs>